Hey, what up? It's your boy Random Robo here, and today, you see it, we're finally playing What Lies in the Multiverse. Not the demo, the real game, it's actually here. We're playing it, we're jumping straight into it. Ooh, I'm excited, guys. Multiple events, multiple possibilities, multiple consequences. Behind each event, behind each possible outcome, hides a new different reality. We've seen this part in the demo, but I'm still gonna go through with it. I'm not gonna skip anything. Parallel realities happening at the same time. Infinite parallel worlds. And who knows, maybe in one of them, we can do something more. A reality in which we're able to know everything, where we can see what we cannot even imagine. And then, we could explore the entire multiverse. We did all this in a demo, but we're gonna go through it once again. Cause we're not skipping anything, guys. Yes, mom. It's not a game, mom. It's a very important okay. I think he doesn't get it, Erwin. If I could make this work, I'd be able to simulate all possible for the same event. And you know what that means. Meow, that you'll shut up. That's right, buddy. I can simulate parallel universes. Just imagine the possibilities. The cat is like, I'm tired of you. Okay, I think that should be enough for now. Ready to test it? How exciting. Good, let's see how it goes. What the? Nani? I mean, ah, uh, that doesn't look well. Uh, what was that? Erwin, help! Meow? Oh well. He's finally gone! Hmm? Bill? Tell me. What's that? Uh, it looks like a rat. Should I burn it? Uh, not again. I'm telling you, just like the last time in the demo, those guys are looking almost like the guys from Among Us. But anyway, we're here! Our adventure begins. Ugh, my head! What happened? And... Oh, my child! Where am I? So... We can control the character now. Cool. This feels amazing. Let's talk to this nice old man. Excuse me, sir, do you know where we are? Oh, my child, there is no real answer for that question. We could be everywhere, but also nowhere. Only time can decide, and so do you, little lamb. Alright, thanks. Anyway... Um, yeah, I played this game before. Not sure when, I think it was a couple months ago. And... I had a lot of fun! Almost forgot about it until recently. Anyway, excuse me! Oh, a lost soul wandering through our meadows. 
What is an aimless young man looking for in these places? But it's not about where you are, brother. It's about when. Don't forget that the idea of space is irrelevant for our conscience. Gotcha. <clears throat> I have to go. We did all this stuff before, but for the... No! Oh my, I forgot about that. Like I was saying, we did all this before, but, f but for the new viewers, I'm gonna do it again. That hurt. What the hell happened to this place? Hmm. We both know what happened to this place. Time happened to this place. What's this? So weird. Am I still in the same place? You are. Just in a different time. gonna meet our friend. I haven't played this game in a, in a super long time. And it's getting quiet. Yep, this is where we meet our friend. Very interesting character. What the? You are. <laughs> are you trying to give me a heart attack? Anyway, damn, what a great entrance. Okay, kid, time to go. <laughs> what? Come on, kid. I don't have all day. You gave me enough trouble already, and this whole mess won't fix itself. What? What are you talking about? By your damn simulation, of course. It's screwing up all my work. And how the hell am I supposed to locate the issue if you keep moving all over the place? Do you know how difficult it is to search for someone in the entire multiverse? Wait, multiverse? Who are you? Uh. Ha! Sorry, I always forget to introduce myself. I'm Everett. Renowned physicist from Universe Zero. Not exactly a pleasure. Universe... Another universe? You're not very quick, are you, kid? Can you stop spinning around? Listen, kid. I have to fix this whole mess, and I need your cooperation for that. Remember where you showed up when you got here? Kid! Uh, over there, I think? I think? I imagine you a little more useful, boy. But hey, it's something. I'll wait for you there. What just happened? That's your best friend. What is this? I'm calling it! Something big is gonna happen right here. I just know it. You're late. For what? For stopping your simulation, of course. Did you listen to anything I said? 
Is this the place where you appeared? Uh, no. It was further above here. And what are we waiting for? First we need to get over there. But how do we get there? There's this thing blocking the way. What? That thing? Ta-da! There you go. Can we continue now? What? Where? How? What did you do? I took us to another universe. What else? We are in another universe? This is going to be a long day, isn't it? Okay, kid. You put us in this situation, so I'll just leave you to do the work. Just call when you want to go to the other universe, and I'll take you there. I'll take you there. <laughs> I'm just playing. Easy, right? I can't believe this. Okay, in the meantime, I'll go on ahead. Don't make me wait too long. Yeah, it's amazing, isn't it? Finally! RT. Got it. <clears throat> Hopefully I remember everything. Look how peaceful it is. Oh crap, I forgot about that! That is so jacked up! He was alive a second ago! Okay, he's still alive! Let's talk to him. That is not true. I don't have the heart to break it to him. Let's move on. I don't have the heart to break it to him. Oh, forgot about that. Oh, we got an achievement. Philadelphia Experiment. <clears throat> got it. Oh, forgot about that. did it. Now what? Um, oh, okay. Uh, I'm still not gonna get used to that. Oh, he's such a nice guy. Oh, man. Excuse me. Can we go up here? I guess not. Hmm. <clears throat> okay. I think I remember what to do here. <clears throat> Got it. Got it. This game is so amazing, so beautiful, man. Okay, okay, okay. 
Okay, let's try again. Let's try again. Got it. Oh, that is so grim. That is so dark right there. But let's meet up with our friend now. I think we're close. Yep. Hey! Ahem. <clears throat> Kid, that took an eternity. Oh, man like me don't have that much time to spare, you know. <laughs> anyway, you're here now. Is this the place where you appeared? Yep, right here. Perfect, let's go then. Nice mess. Wait, what? What are we doing here? Fixing what you cause, obviously. Is that your computer? Yeah! Finally. What the hell? I had serious work on there! Ha! <laughs> and what work it was, damn it. No less than simulating universes by yourself. I don't know what happened exactly, kid, but... The thing you made was causing me a lot of trouble. Suddenly I couldn't travel through universes correctly, and everything indicated that it was your fault. I can't just let you continue your work if that means I can't do mine, right? Alrighty then. I guess I have nothing more to do here. Avoid getting me into- Wait! Everett, right? Can I... can I go with you? <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. I'm serious. What's the point of simulating other worlds if I can't go to them myself? You travel through universes, I don't know how you do it, but that's more awesome than anything I could ever achieve here. Imagine all the stuff I could see with you. Oh, you're actually serious. Boy, you don't know what you're getting into. The multiverse is no place for a kid like you. It's dark, dangerous, and I don't have time to babysit you while I work. Still, please, I'll be helpful. I could even work as an assistant if you need one. Assistant, huh? Well, I can't deny I've been needing one for a while now. I guess I should give you some credit after all. You somehow managed to screw up my work, and I respect that. I'll do my best, I promise. Hey. I guess I don't have much to lose. You could certainly help me with some things. Okay, kid, I'll give you a chance, but we'll have to leave immediately. Are you serious? Awesome! You won't regret this, Everett, I swear! I bet he wasn't regretting it until you said that, but whatever. Anyway, of course not, as long as you don't die in the process. Wait, what? Anyway, let's go! The cat is like, what the- oh, we got an achievement! The young, the old, and the hat? Cool. Among us friends again. Dan, tell me, who are they? Uh, damn it, wrong universe. That's enough, Bill. I'm going back to my parents. Chapter 1, Unstable. <clears throat>
<laughs> what? You should be more careful, kid. That fog could have killed you. Whoa, where are we? Alpha... Alpha Orionis. This is the universe I'm investigating at the moment. I've been getting weird signals from an island located somewhere in this universe for a while. And some sources indicate that it could be exactly what I'm looking for. But it's far away, really far away. We'll need some sort of vehicle if we want to reach it. An island, a vehicle, does that mean that you can't simply teleport there? Well, no, you see. How does it work then? You... Kid! Stop it, kid! Kid! Easy now. We'll have time for questions later. What's important now is to get something that can take us to that island. I can manage that. And as for you, it would be a waste to not investigate this area while you wait, don't you think? So you want me to explore it in the meantime? Hey, it seems that you're not that slow after all. Hey, wait a minute. If I'm not mistaken, there should be a village called Millville at the edge of this forest. You tour the area while I get a vehicle, and we'll meet there once I'm ready. Everything clear? Sounds fun. Can I still travel between universes while I'm exploring? Of course. That's the reason why you're here after all. Oh, and take this. Some directions in case you get lost. We got a freaking achievement. Awesome cakes. The first of many. Okay, so we did that. This is incredible. It's finally happening. Let me drink some water, guys. Oh my gosh, the reading. Fun game, though, but... Woo! Oh, there we go. We got it. We got it. What's this? Millville. Cool. Stop it. Get some help. We need a key. There's the key. Dear travelers, the Ranger Committee will not take care of abandoned belongings. All found objects will be left in convenient places for others to find them. Kisses, the Forest Ranger- Oh, I remember this. And if we do this, it's the opposite, the complete opposite. <laughs> okay, that, that was amazing. That was, that was comedy. So let's open his door now. Okay. So we need a key. We need a key. No. Not quite. Oh! I am an idiot. I am so silly. So let's open that door now. Ah, look at nature. Oh, we need another key. 
So we gotta go down, down, down. Oh no, I remember this guy. He dies, no. Damn you, game. Why'd you remind? Oh, that is so sad. There he is. Let's talk to him. My grandma used to say that patience will be rewarded, and she was always right. So I decided to just wait here for the fish to appear. How about that? I love your optimism. Okay, time it right? No, no. We gotta time it right. Got it. So we got the key. We did that. Cool. Wait, what? The tree's glitching out? Yeah, I remember this. What? It's broken. Like that gorilla song, Broken. I love me some gorillas. I kinda wish I could play that in the background, but I can't. Copyright. Careful. Studies say that falling from big heights can be bad for your health. The Ranger Committee reminds you to always be sure that there is visible ground below before you jump somewhere. Watch out. Gotcha. And if you do this, it's gonna say jump. Go ahead. You have nothing to lose. But your life. Oh, so we need a key. We need a key. We gotta find a key. There's our friend. We're not gonna talk to him yet. What the hell happened? Day four! The fat guy hasn't returned yet, and we've run out of all remaining food. At this rate, I doubt we'll receive any kind of help. Day nine. The storm still hasn't stopped. Mary is already affected by the weather. She looks really sick. <clears throat> looks like she's zombified. Day 13, only Susie and I remain. I don't trust her, damn it. Her eyes give me goosebumps. They're making me nervous. I've started to hallucinate, and it looks like she has too, maybe. I swear I saw her eyes turning yellow for a second. It was me or her. I didn't want to. I promise. I promise. Wow. That was grim. So we got two items so far. Um, oh, oh, okay. Wait, wait. We do this. Got the key. We got the key. I might call it a day after I'm done talking to this guy first. Because I've been playing for a while. For at least a good 30 minutes, I think. Everett? Hey, kid. How's it going? I thought you were looking for a vehicle while I explored. That's what I'm doing. <clears throat> Excuse me. That kind waiter gave me some useful information on where to look. You have to pay for that coffee, buddy. <laughs> what a nice guy. Anyway, 
Have you seen anything interesting around here? Yeah, I saw a really weird tree over there glitching out and whatnot. Ah, uh, yeah. And ubiquitous. I think I said that right, ubiquitous. And ubiquitous? What is that? Nothing important. Objects trapped between two worlds, basically. Whoa, why? Because the multiverse is chaotic, alright? Don't think too much about it, kid. It's not worth it. We'll see a lot more of them on our way, probably. Alright. Now listen, apparently there's a bar in Millville where I can get some help. Keep doing your thing, and I'll see you over there later. Alright? Sure. Good. I'm on my way, then. I'll let you buy the coffee this time. I don't have any mo- I don't have any money! <laughs> he forgot to tell you I'm broke, right?